uh, first off, as you know, we had a terrific recruiting year. So we don't know what the other teams are doing, but I feel that uh, we are going to be in contention for that Ivy title. I don't really want to say much more than that. I don't know w uh, what the other teams look like until the Ivy scrimmage at Yale in the middle of November. But um, there's a terrific energy with the team. The captains are doing an excellent job. And uh, we're on track and excited. What more can I say? So our two men's captains, uh, Jason Mihas and Will Ahmed, um, and two of the hardest working guys on the team last year. And they've come back and they're leading by example. So, you know, when it comes to hitting the gym, hitting the weights, um, and doing the aerobic and anaerobic work that's required, they are absolutely, you know, up front and center. Um, and they're, they're, they're getting the job done. I'm delighted that they're captains. They're the, they're the best captains to have, I think, on the squad, and they're, they're doing their job. Ali Farag from Egypt is clearly going to be our number one. Um, and Nick Hopcroft from England is looking to be in the top three. So, of course, the higher the order, uh, higher up the order they are, the better. And for sure, Julian Kirby, the American uh, number one um, in his junior year, and Tyler Olsen from Canada will definitely be impact players, i.e. they're going to be in the top nine. And I suspect that they could end up being in that middle three. So not just are they all on the team, but the fact that they are playing in such high positions, pushing people down is, is, uh, is helping you know, in, in a huge way. Where it's really tight is, and I'm sure it is on most, if not all teams, is that for that bottom three, so we've got the two captains, uh, uh, Jason and Will, Alex Mars come back, uh, of course, and he's up there. So there's probably about four, five, six guys who are gonna be fighting for in, to get into that bottom three, because we had eight walk-ons this year, which is phenomenal. Our squad is 23 players. The coaches will always have expectation, uh, but really it's just to do with their attitude. Um, so this is early days, but I can tell you right now that they are starting out where we finished last year. Um, and what I mean by that is, is the fact that they are addressing what we had highlighted through the season last year. Some is technical, some is tactical, and a lot is mental. So there's a different attitude. And with that, you can do anything with the right attitude and we're getting on with it.